What's up, Tube? And welcome back to another daily edition of Big Al's Barber Vlogs. If you are new to our channel, I welcome you. We are a great resource for barbers, barber students, and barber shop owners. Let's get into this, guys. Every day is a win. Since I was told that you don't want me. Baby, you're just calling. You know I try to hold on to when I see you move. So today is Monday, guys. Monday, uh, I believe it's like March 26th or it's the end of the month already, man. This month is already gone. Three months out of the year is already over. Nine months till Christmas. Seven months till I get married. Uh, for those of you guys that are new to my channel, you guys don't know I'm getting married in, uh, in August. So there's already like planning and things going on with us and uh, we're preparing for this big day. Uh, got a honeymoon to go to this year so there's a lot of uh, uh, events and things coming up this year that are keeping my mind and uh and uh you know and my finances in order you know i have to really really uh, um be careful of what i'm doing right now because uh there's such big events coming up this year you know especially the, the uh, my my wedding my wedding's a it's a, you know it's a special day for me and my lady and uh for those of you guys don't know that are new to the channel i'm not married i'm going to be married this year uh i've been with my girl for seven years going on seven years just this year will be seven years we've been together already so we've been together for a little while already you know so um it's finally it's gonna be it's time to, to i think it's seven or six years I think it's six, maybe six years, but um, I know we've been together for a long time, so that's what, that's what's coming up this year. Uh, we were gonna go camping, but camping got canceled. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things going on in our house right now that you know my girl can't really get away from the house, so we decided not to go camping. Uh, uh, but I am going to the CT Barber Expo for the for those of you guys that those of you guys that haven't heard, I'm going to the CT Barber Expo. I'm gonna do a. a a vlog per day while I'm there just to take you guys with me and show you guys exactly I'm also you know I'm gonna go to the, I, I bought the VIP ticket for the Barber Expo so I'm actually gonna be going to uh, this is the first year they're doing Barber Grammys so uh, I'll be there for that too also so uh, uh, you know just gonna be there and and, and, and show that just uh, the, the main you know the, the main reason why I'm going to this not only because of the uh, for the fact that it's the Super Bowl of barber battles, uh, I'm also going to go compete, you know, and and it's going to 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 really really network with with all the other uh, uh, YouTube barbers and and the YouTube industry and the, the barber industry and all together because this industry is getting bigger and bigger and you know and since I'm already in this YouTube. I might as well get down there and you know I gotta take my take my seat at the table I, I figure you know what I mean so I'm gonna go down there vlog do interviews and uh, really bring it all to you guys so that you guys can experience it for those of you guys that can't make it out there and then maybe you guys can start thinking about maybe in the future maybe one of you guys going out to this uh, uh, to this event because it, it is one of the biggest events in in, in the United States but just letting you guys in uh, a little info on what what what's coming up in this year the rest of this year uh so we got a lot of things coming up uh and in the meantime we just keep grinding keep grinding keep grinding keep grinding every day every day you know what i mean or at least my five days uh you know you know that everybody everybody has to work guys this is, that's what it is you know if you guys ain't up today you guys ain't working then uh uh I need to. I think you guys need to reevaluate yourselves, you know, because a uh, uh, Monday is a work day unless your shop is closed. If your shop is closed, then you know there's nothing you can do about it. But and if your shop is closed, you need to reevaluate your hours. I think because you know we are in a customer-based business, and a customer-based business, we need to be there every single day. That, I, I, that's my feelings. Uh, with that being said, that's my intro for this morning. You guys have a great morning. I'll see you guys at lunch. Grind on.
So today is Monday. Today just me and J-Lo are working. Uh, Mondays is always just me and J-Lo uh, for now until we get our full crew. Once we get our full crew, then um, then she'll probably, uh, she'll still work Mondays, but we'll probably bring in another person in on Monday. Uh, right now, as of right now, I just kind of changed a little bit up. So hold on a second, all right? I got a phone call. So we're right now we're we're we you know we, we haven't been rolling with a full crew for it's been years, guys. I, I had a full crew one time and it didn't last very long. Uh, you know, it, it seems when you got a full crew like that, you know, it, not that it makes things worse, but it just you know everybody gets a little bit slower. Uh, they make a little bit less money because they're spread out more with amongst all the barbers. But that's why I tell my barbers that they, they need to uh, uh, apply themselves and, and you know. And uh, do haircuts, post them, and and you know what? And promote yourself. Promote yourself because you know if you don't promote yourself, you can't expect somebody to promote you. Promote for you. You have to be active with your own social media accounts, posting pictures, posting videos, um, you know, hashtagging things, uh, 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 going onto other people's pages and liking so that they could come back and check your 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 stuff and, and that's how you get them guys that's how you get them you no know, i i don't know if you guys know about this about instagram but if you go on instagram if you're set, if you're set up properly on your page and you're posting constantly posting pictures of haircuts and videos okay you post those up there to show people that you know what you're doing okay now if you go to your search, when you're on your own page on your Instagram, you go to your search and you search uh, places. If you go, when you go to search, it's gonna come up people, things, and places. When you go to places, um, it's gonna search all the nearby places. It's gonna say a little thing right there, search nearby places. You click that. Once you click that, you're gonna see all the businesses that, that come up around your area. Like here in Azusa where I live, if I click places, first thing that comes up is Azusa Pacific University, Citrus College, uh, Starbucks. You know, there's gonna, there's all kinds of different uh, uh, locations around my area. A lot of restaurants. Every restaurant has its own place. Okay, I'm gonna use APU for an, for for an example. That's Azusa Pacific. You go to Azusa Pacific. Every single picture that's hashtag with APU or Azusa Pacific is gonna be on there. Okay, if you go on every single picture and you just click like. Click like, and what happens is that person is gonna go back to your page and see who you are because you click like on their picture. Once they click like on that, I don't know about you guys, but me, when somebody new clicks, uh, 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 starts following me on my page, what I always do is go back and look at their stuff, see why they're following me, see what, if they're a barber, you know, like. Um, so that's your trick, you know? You post up great pictures, great haircuts, you uh, like their their page so that it directs them to your page. Once they get you to their, your page, they're gonna see all your haircuts, your what you're doing. You know that's why it's important to have a a, a, a nice clean uh, 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 haircuts and nice clean uh, uh, pictures that show everything that you do. Try to keep personal stuff out of your your own uh, 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 business page. Although I post. I post once in a while. I'll post personal things, and the reason why is to sh just to show my clients that I'm a human being. Also, I'm a person. You know, I have a family, and I have a, uh, and I go places and and do things just like they do, just like you do. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, it's good to always throw a little bit of personal up there, but try to keep your page separate. Try to keep it all business. You know, when they go in there, you go to my page, you're gonna have to scroll down a little bit, and you'll see something personal. But most of the time, it's all business, all business, haircuts, uh, uh, you know, vlogs, talking about different things that I do for my business you know same thing with you that's what you guys got to do you guys got to generate generate walk-ins to your place to your place where you're working at and the way you do is by messing up your timeline this is what I could this is what they call messing up your timeline you go on there and just click like click like click like go on to the next place go to just call it click like click like click like click like keep going down all the way down male female it doesn't matter you you click like and what's gonna do is they're gonna go to your page see that you know how to cut hair and direct their boyfriend, husband, kids, hus uh, 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 themselves. They're gonna bring their children. They're gonna come to your establishment because they're gonna be seen that you know how to cut hair. So keep that in mind. That's my tip for this afternoon. All right, guys. I'm gonna finish this day off strong, and then we end this, I'll end it with that good outro. All right, guys. I'll see you guys in a little while. Keep grinding. 
So that's it for today, guys. This day is over. Uh, man, it ended up being a crazy day for me and J-Lo. Uh, she did 15 haircuts. I did 14 haircuts for a Monday. Come on, you can't, be, you can't beat that, guys. Uh, you know what I mean? It's, Mondays is a great day for working, guys. I don't know if you guys work on Mondays, but if you guys don't, I encourage you guys to add that on to your repertoire of days because you know what? I'll let you guys know right now. Mondays is a great day to go to work, guys. Great day. Um, today I went live at right around four o'clock on the last two haircuts, and I, I don't know if you guys saw the video I went on there. I really, you know, when I'm going live like that and I'm and I'm working, I'm not really cutting and watching the video. So if you guys ask questions after the videos, I'm gonna go on and I'm gonna try to answer your questions. But during the time I'm cutting, I kind of just put my phone up. I have a, tri a single stand. This is what I'm using right now. It's a, it's called a monopod single stand uh, a leg that just holds up my phone and, and uh, uh, I just go on and I go on live but I just kind of want to give you guys a little taste of what it's like to do a haircut inside the barbershop during the barbershop I don't know if you know for you guys that, that are just getting started and you guys want to see your you want to see what it's like inside here I, I I throw it on there and throw it on live so you guys can check it out but that's it for today guys this day is over this week is over tomorrow's my day off uh, tomorrow, Tuesday and Wednesday to tomorrow. I'm going to try to drop another tutorial. I'm going to try videos. I'm trying to drop videos every day, guys. You know, I know how this works. I'm trying to drive, drop content, but I'm trying to drop content that has value. Something that brings something to you that helps you progress your career, you know, in, into, into the future, you know? So I'm just trying to give you guys my, uh, 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 you know what I what goes on here? What happens here at, at this shop? And so that way you guys can carry on to your shop and, and you know, whether you be a barber shop owner, be a barber or be a barber student, because you know what? Steps to everything, guys. Everybody stops down here and they gotta climb your way up. Believe me, I'm not up here. I'm right here in the middle. I'm still climbing. I wanna get higher and higher and higher. Just like you. So we do, we grow together, we stay together, we do we do this together, guys. So Keep grinding and keep subscribing and keep smashing that thumbs up, thumbs down, no, thumbs up. And uh, you know what? We'll, we'll grow together, guys. We'll grow together. On another note, uh, CT Barber Expo, guys. Let me know what you guys think about that, guys. It's coming up, coming up quick. Uh, I am going for sure. Uh, it's going to be a four-day trip for me because I'm going up on uh, Saturday, Sunday, which is the uh, first day of the show, Monday, which is the second day of the show, and I come back on Tuesday. So Monday, I'm trying to set some things up. I'm going to go visit, uh, um, I don't know if you guys heard of Al Millennium's Barber Academy. It's out there in Connecticut. I'm going to go out there and check him out. I want to visit his school. I've already contacted him. He's going to try to, he's going to uh, uh, have me over and show me around his school. His school, his, he's just right now basically... Upgraded the school, got a new building, so he's just getting, I think it's opening up this month, so I'm excited because it's going to be a brand new school. I'm going to go get to check it out on that first Saturday. Plus, I, I, I'm going to get a hold of him. I don't know if you watch my vlogs, Al, but if you do, I need a, I need a, I, I need a, I need a model for the fade and beard in Connecticut at the CT Barber Expo, so I don't know. Al, if you watch my vlogs, reach out to me, bro. I'm not even going to reach out to you. Reach out to me. Let me know if you... If you watch my vlogs and you see this, I need a model for a beard and fade, okay, guys? Beard and fade over there in Connecticut. If somebody else out there knows somebody, let me know. Uh, you know, it's, that's one thing about going to a show like this is that you really, you really can't take your models with you. So you have to kind of like look for models over there. So I don't know what they look like. I don't know what their hair is like. I don't know. It's not like I'm ever going to cut them again or, you know I me. Mean? But this is, I'm going to try it. This is a Super Bowl of hair show. So I want to go out there and compete. And I want to vlog it for you guys so you take you guys firsthand, all right, guys? So I'm going to take you guys day by day. It's going to be a four-part vlog. Every day I'm going to vlog a different day. So I'll show you guys, take you guys with me and so we, so we can do this together, all right, guys? With that being said, that's it for this week. This vlog is getting long. So see you guys on Thursday. Grind on. And I'm going to drop in those uh, tutorials this weekend, all right? You guys have a blessed night. Grind on.